pretty smile from this and of course good afternoon Frankie Cyril. Uh, good afternoon Lady B, Thank mesdames you. et messieurs, bonsoir. Bonsoir et bienvenue sur Dimanche chez nous. Dimanche chez nous, c'est bel et bien la plateforme qui nous permet bien sûr de perpétuer le divertissement chez vous. Ça, c'est tous les dimanches entre 15h et 16h30. Nous vous donnons bien sûr le là en ce qui concerne le divertissement. Vous avez choisi d'être des nôtres. Merci bien évidemment pour cette marque de sympathie et de confiance que vous nous accordez encore ce jour. Je voudrais vous dire énormément merci parce que euh, si vous n'êtes pas là nous n'avons pas de raison d'être ici et puis si vous êtes là, ça donne tout le sens à ce que nous faisons les dimanches pour vous tenir en haleine. D'ici là, je suis convaincu que euh, nous allons passer des moments extrêmement agréables. D'ailleurs nous vous le souhaitons dans tous les cas nous avons euh, bel et bien prévu des rubriques aussi alléchantes les unes que les autres pour euh, votre entretien euh, durant bel et bien ces moments que nous allons échanger ensemble. Alors, c'est bel et bien la dernière production en ce qui concerne le mois d'octobre, ça c'est vrai. Et le mois de novembre, c'est demain. Et il paraît que les princes sont nés en novembre et les princesses sont nées en octobre. Suivez mon regard. Alors, demain, nous attaquons un mois fort et nous souhaitons tout le meilleur à ceux-là qui sont nés durant le mois de novembre. Vous êtes une princesse, vous êtes un prince, ça c'est sûr. Si vous êtes né en novembre, c'est ceux-là même qui parfois, et quand on n'est pas attentif, on les compte un mois pour un an. Alors, euh, ça avait des répercussions en son temps, mais peut-être plus maintenant parce que les parents sont devenus sages. Et bel et bien, cette semaine, nous avons bien sûr eu l'insigne honneur de traiter quelques petits problèmes que nous avons bien évidemment mis sur votre attention. Alors, pour le compte de ce soir, je voudrais vous signifier que nous allons, une fois de plus, nous en sortir de la plus belle des manières en restant avec vous. Thank filles. you so much, Frankie. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday Happy to you, Happy start of, you know, the month of November. Yes, the month happy of... Happy end of the weekend. Yes. <laughs> All right, we wish you the same, ladies and gentlemen. We wish you the same production room. All the best come the month of, you know, November 2021. All those who were born in the course of the month of November, remember, next week, we're just going to give you nothing but a big shout out from this end. As far as your birthdays are concerned, Okay, we ask in this afternoon, we open up the page dedication. We ask in this afternoon, should a man have full monopoly over his salary without telling the wife how much he earns? Should a man have a full monopoly, full control, good, over his salary without telling the wife how much he earns? That's the question for the D. We write through the uh, the program from this end. Numbers are in front of your screen. You can reach us this afternoon. In the meantime, if you're watching us, it's your birthday today. It's the birthday of your son, your brother, your sister, your husband, your wife, mother, father, nephew, even click. Why not? Tell them happy birthday. Of course, we're going to take them. So keep sending your birthday wishes. And we're going to take them live. And we give you nothing but a big shout out from this end. Happy start of uh, the month of uh, November to the 10 regions of Cameroon. Uh, I just pray we all keep praying hard for nothing but the very best out of, you know, the promised land. I'm going to call Cameroon the promised <laughs> land. Of course, that's where we are. All right, dedication or dedicates, Frank history. Mm, tout à fait. Alors, je voudrais bel et bien rapidement prendre la question du jour qui est bel et bien en bas de votre petit écran. Hein? Est-ce qu'un homme doit prendre son salaire, entièrement le contrôle de son salaire, sans dire à son épouse combien il gagne par mois Alors, est-ce qu'un homme a le droit de ne pas dire à son épouse combien il gagne par mois Bon, ben voilà, c'est la question de ce soir. Vous pouvez participer en nous envoyant vos SMS au numéro qui sont affichés au bas de votre petit écran. Alors, mais n'oubliez pas qu'en participant, dites-nous exactement où est-ce que vous nous envoyez votre SMS pour que nous puissions, bien sûr, nous rassurer. Je vous je voudrais au même moment dire bonsoir à une très charmante dame. 
une dame qui nous regarde étrangement tous les dimanches. J'ai fait la maladresse de ne pas prendre son nom. J'ai oublié. J'ai pris son nom, mais j'ai oublié. Je voudrais dire à son fils qui m'a interpellé en semaine, me dit, ma maman regarde dimanche chez nous, tous les dimanches que Dieu a créé. Elle va se reconnaître actuellement, elle va se dire, ah, France Cyril, comment tu as oublié ça Non, c'est pas grave, envoyez-moi un SMS. Envoyez le SMS au numéro qui s'affiche au bas de l'écran. Et je suis convaincu qu'on va se retrouver parce que je sais qu'elle est en train de nous regarder actuellement parce que son fils a dit, je vais dire à un moment qu'on va lui dédier l'émission de dimanche et elle sera devant la télé. Alors, fais-moi un plaisir, envoie-moi le nom de maman et par SMS le quartier et exactement nous allons lui faire une belle fleur ce soir. Merci de nous regarder. Pour tous ceux-là qui nous regardent, vous pouvez faire de même. Hein. Envoyez-nous juste des SMS et nous nous en tiendrons exclusivement là. Je voudrais déjà dire chapeau à cette maman qui a décidé que NG Télévision chez elle. Personne ne touche le bouton, personne ne touche la télécommande. Et c'est un contrôle, c'est NG TV. Point bas. Alors je voudrais vous dire merci madame. Elle est commerçante quelque part dans la ville de Bafsam. Envoyez-nous le SMS et j'espère qu'on pourra l'avoir avant la fin de ce programme. La question je vais la rappeler tout de suite est ce qu'un homme doit prendre le contrôle de son salaire il doit prendre tout son salaire et moi je dois jamais dire à son épouse combien il touche par mois alors si vous êtes d'accord envoyez nous la réponse par sms si vous n'êtes pas d'accord envoyez nous toujours votre point de vue par sms c'est bel et bien la thématique de ce jour merci à vous Merci de tout cœur. Nous allons prendre la première pause musicale qui est bel et bien une chanson que nous dédions à la première personne qui nous a fait un SMS la semaine dernière, le week-end dernier. Vous nous avez fait le SMS, nous vous envoyons cette belle chanson hein, qui nous vient de l'Est Cameroun. Nous sommes allés dans l'Est Cameroun, Empereur Kassel, bel et bien l'artiste que nous faisons découvrir tout de suite et maintenant.
the ninja. Don't want for the game, man, man, the mission. Hey, yeah, double John down. Hey, yeah, double John down. That way, yeah, that way, yeah. That way, yeah, that way, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna tell you, man, I'm gonna go down, John. Don't want for the game, man, by the ninja. Don't want for the game, man, man, the mission. Hey, yeah, double John down. La chanson, la musique qui emporte le public, l'empereur Kans, l'enfant chouchou, chouchou. Voilà. Bien, empereur Kans, du côté de l'Est Cameroun, j'espère que les ressortissants de l'Est qui euh, nous euh, regardent un peu partout dans le monde ont été extrêmement satisfaits. Je vous l'ai dit, généralement, les musiques que nous diffusons sur ce programme sont des musiques qui invitent bien évidemment à vous rappeler d'où vous venez. Et je voudrais dire bonsoir à tous ceux-là qui nous regardent. À l'Est, je voudrais faire un clin d'œil à notre correspondant de ce côté-là, Matamba. Je voudrais dire bonsoir à tous les réfugiés. Hein que vous nous veniez du Tchad, du Nigeria, de la Centrafrique et que vous êtes dans les camps de réfugiés à l'Est. Il y en a beaucoup là-bas, les DB, beaucoup du côté de l'Est Cameroun. Nous vous disons bonsoir et euh, beaucoup de courage. Et après la pluie, c'est le beau temps, ça c'est sûr. Alors, c'était bel et bien la première chanson pour le compte de cette émission. Nous vous souhaitons tous les meilleurs.
Thank you so much, uh, Frankie Cyril, for that wonderful selection there, ladies and gentlemen, all the way from the east region of the country. You know, when I was watching that dance, Miss V could not help but to shake the body a little, you understand? <laughs> and I was like, oh, come on, this guy must be one of those who are really, you know, <coughs> you understand from that? <laughs> yeah, no, but the sound is excellent, it's cool. I really enjoyed the way they were dancing, and it's a beautiful selection, the Frankie Story. And of course, special dedication, first writer last week. Hope you did enjoy that beautiful piece there. Second song for the day, it's equally reserved for the last writer. Last week is going to be for your dancing and viewing pleasure. This afternoon, if you're just tuning in, you're on Sunday at home. And uh, television, that's our platform where we give you that opportunity as an artist, a musician, a designer, fashion designer, culture, you know designer and so on to come live with us here and share this moment with us now aside that maybe you run a big restaurant in town you run a big business center you are an entrepreneur and so on this is that so platform across ng television where you normally join us and before you know it we make your voice to be heard in this generation to make somebody know that you matter in this generation so that's it there it doesn't matter where you are distance is not a barrier whether you're in the west region in Buffalo some or not, uh, part two, Cameroon, other uh, countries out of Cameroon, numbers are in front of your screen there where you can just, you know, text or call and we would be at your service. Meantime, we ask in this afternoon, should the man have a full monopoly over his salary without telling the wife how much he and what do you think about that ladies and gentlemen that's the question for the day most often you realize uh, especially authoritative men i'm sorry you're frankly siri i mean no respect this uh, uh, no disrespect this afternoon <laughs> yeah. especially authoritative men uh, they feel that they can just jury the salary you know the way the one they forget that the two shall become one so the two shall become one everything but not in salary no uh, should the man have full monopoly over his salary without telling the wife how much he earns now you are focus this afternoon is the man the man you understand because how is that possible for a woman to have full monopoly over her salary even without telling the husband the man will not take it so this Okay. J'évite de me mixer dans les problèmes des couples d'autrui. Oui. Donc, euh, je, je préfère laisser chacun gérer son couple comme il l'entend. Il y en a qui vont vous dire euh, non, l'argent du mari, c'est l'argent du mari. Donc, euh, de, de l'argent des femmes, de, Oui, déjà qu'on ne regarde même pas beaucoup votre argent. <rire> et ce qui est sûr, c'est que vous faites de ça ce que vous voulez. On ne regarde pas beaucoup. Même quand vous avez pour vous, vous venez encore prendre encore pour nous. Donc, euh, je me
the women are in love with this so much for hair, you know, stuff, you know, hair kind of things, <laughs> hair, beauty, and so on. Cocoa butter, cocoa oil, cocoa body sprays, cocoa, you know, laundry and bathing soaps, cocoa syrups, even. Yeah, cocoa, you know, syrups. So, all these, the lots of, you know, other things from the cocoa beans. When I talk about cocoa, we are talking about the cocoa beans. Let me be more precise. Cocoa beans is what comes out from the cocoa pot. Mm. You know, you harvest, you open, you split open, or you split good the the cocoa the cocoa pots, the mm. round thing there, and you remove the thank you production room. That's the cocoa pots. That's the cocoa. Yeah. Good. So when we crack that stuff now, what we take out of it is the cocoa beans. We get the cocoa beans now. We dry now. Mind you, good. I was looking for these cocoa beans. Thank you so much. What is white in there is the cocoa, cocoa beans, beans, ladies and gentlemen. We get this stuff now. There are lots of persons who say it is excellent for the health, especially when it's damn sweet. You just suck. Yes, I happen to be a lover of it. If I have it right now in front of me, I won't mind, you know, sipping some. So you can just even use it as a dessert that's in between or before meals something extra that you take mm. cocoa too can play that role and it's good equally for those who are feeling you know uh nusitic. you can as well get the cocoa beans as it is fresh like that and you just you know suck that stuff and it brings back your appetite it takes you out of the nusitic feeling and so on and before you know it you're fine so that's the cocoa there. The cocoa beans now, we dry it. You see, that's the dry version there, Frankie Suri. Yeah. We dry it, ladies and gentlemen. Apart from, you know, drying it and selling it good, you can have cocoa butter. Like we have it there. That's cocoa butter. Good. Aside cocoa butter, you see the cocoa powder by the side? And the spoon there, good. That cocoa powder, you can use it for so many, many other end products. Syrups. Uh, uh, we've already said it, syrups, you understand, body sprays, bathing and laundry soaps, or, or tavio, you understand, good. So that's it, the cocoa beans and cocoa powder. Now, we can equally use it for medicinal purposes, in as much as we use it for fashion and beauty. It can be used as well for medicinal purposes, you understand. So that's the, the about cocoa. There are lots of others. Maybe we're just bringing you the few. If we want to dig deep, we want to do more research, you realize that there are many other things that cocoa can do. Thank you, production room. Many other things that cocoa can come out from cocoa that we maybe don't know. You have the chocolates, you have cakes made yeah. out of cocoa, chocolate cakes and so on, cocoa, you know, understand, made with cocoa and so on. So that's it, the ladies and gentlemen. You have the white chocolate, even sometimes so a little bit of cocoa is attached to it. You have the brown chocolate and so on. All that has to do with cocoa. So that's it there, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, maybe we didn't really meet your expectations this afternoon, but never mind. Uh, someday, one can never tell. We will come over to tell you these are more discoveries coming out from, you know, that single crop called cocoa. This are uh, body, you know, lotion, uh, bathing soap, good, made out of cocoa. As you see there, it can be used as laundry soap, it can be used as bathing soap. You have cocoa butter as well. Excellent. It's made out of cocoa. Is there any other one we need to talk on? about this afternoon. Now, mind you, don't forget the cocoa pots, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we crack and remove the cocoa beans. You can as well, you know, split these things bit by bit, bit by bit, bit by bit, you understand? And, you know, go spread it all over the entire farm. Before you know it, it's going to act as, you know, fertilizer, natural fertilizer to boost back the soil fertility. Tea, cocoa tea, tea, coffee made out of mm. cocoa, it's excellent. Production room, thank you so much for bringing the images so that we do not really leave any uh, out. Good. That's cocoa oil. Isn't it beautiful, ladies and gentlemen? See the oil, and you look at the color, you will agree with me that it's cocoa and nothing else. That's cocoa oil. And from the cocoa oil, I'm sure that's where we produce the cocoa butter and so on and so on and so on. It's all about get busy, get rich. That's the slot where we bring you innovational ideas on how to make money from multiple sources. Even from the little pepe we plant and sell in the market. There are lots of things we can do with pepe instead of just sitting there and oh i'm selling pepper market is not going no <laughs> if market is not going the ones that are already getting so weak they are tired and so on produce pepper as a liquid pepper from it 
dry it there are those who are in love with just the powder version of pepe and so on you see miss b has entered pepe now so that's it there body lotions and lots of other things derived from coco coco on board frank is free get busy get me oui, la rubrique « Get busy, get rich », c'est cette rubrique-là qui vous donne eh bel et bien la possibilité de faire des bonnes affaires. Nous venons vous donner la possibilité à partir de certains dérivés et de faire un peu d'argent à côté. Alors, euh, la rubrique vous donne avec beaucoup, beaucoup de précision un certain nombre de choses que vous pouvez faire pour maintenir votre bourse. Alors, euh, nous avons jeté notre dévolu sur le cacao. Euh, nous, nous avons bel et bien pensé qu'en vous parlant, bien sûr, des dérivés du cacao, vous pourrez en profiter, surtout que nous sommes dans une zone fortement agricole. Le cacao tel que vous l'avez, vous avez la partie intérieure. Cette partie intérieure que nous utilisons pour euh, sécher et faire, bien sûr, plein d'autres choses avec. Mais avant d'y aller, permettez-moi de vous dire qu'avec ce que nous voyons là, beaucoup vous diront qu'en suçant, puisque ça a une saveur sucrée, en suçant, ça vous donne beaucoup d'autres éléments que vous devriez bien sûr exploiter pour votre santé. Alors, euh, tout de suite, après avoir sucé, parce que généralement, quand la cabosse est jaune, et c'est bien à l'intérieur. Alors, dès que vous avez cassé, soit vous fermentez, soit vous sucez, vous avez les fèves. Les fèves qui sont là, que vous séchez. Ces fèves bien séchées, mesdames et messieurs, écrasées. Oui, quand vous avez écrasé ces fèves-là, parce que nous ne sommes pas au niveau industriel. Écrasé, ça peut vous permettre d'avoir, euh, par exemple, le beurre de cacao ou encore l'huile de cacao. C'est très important. Ça peut vous permettre d'avoir le beurre, l'huile de cacao ou la farine de cacao, ce qui va vous permettre bien évidemment de faire plein de choses, soit de mettre euh, votre euh, petit déjeuner à contribution donc vous aurez au petit déjeuner avec la poudre vous pouvez faire le déjeuner et cette poudre là qui va permettre que les uns et les autres puissent en sacher, toujours sécher et conserver aussi longtemps que possible, c'est ça le problème, alors euh, vous pouvez le faire pertinemment tout en sachant que en le faisant vous pouvez faire des économies soit revendre pour avoir euh, un peu d'argent donc euh, cette partie est très importante alors vous pouvez aussi à partir de cette poudre faire du chocolat hein, soit du chocolat vous pouvez avoir du chocolat blanc chocolat noir chocolat rouge mais en tout cas vous pouvez faire du chocolat avec à partir de cette poudre là c'est cette poudre là qui vous permet bien évidemment de façonner le cacao en termes de graines que vous avez séchées pour avoir bien sûr oui pour avoir bien sûr votre poudre pour le petit déjeuner aussi ça ça permet bien évidemment que vous puissiez faire des économies au lieu d'aller acheter donc vous avez le chocolat blanc vous avez le chocolat noir Ensuite, vous avez plusieurs types de chocolat que vous pouvez faire avec bien évidemment la poudre de cacao que vous avez préalablement, j'en arrive, sélectionné. Vous pouvez aussi avoir bien sûr le, 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 comment on appelle, le savon, vous pouvez avoir du savon pour les soins de beauté. Les femmes savent de quoi je parle, c'est très important. On vous parlera bien évidemment du cuir chevelure. Alors vous pouvez faire et du café aussi, je voudrais dire le petit déjeuner, pas le café, le petit déjeuner avec bel et bien la poudre de cacao et ça vous êtes sûr que vous aurez une journée assez agréable une très belle journée qui va s'augurer avec bien sûr votre tasse que vous aurez prêt alors c'est bel et bien cette rubrique qui vous permet bien sûr de faire des bonnes affaires c'est bel et bien get busy get rich ou get rich get busy voilà non get busy get rich occupez vous et devenez riche c'est très important get busy Get riche. Alors, n'oubliez pas la question qui est au bas de votre petit écran, mesdames et messieurs. Est-ce qu'un homme doit garder son salaire secret de sa femme Est-ce qu'il doit présenter son salaire Il y en a qui enlèvent à la banque, ils viennent déposer sur la table. Que maman, voici le salaire de ce mois, ainsi de suite. Est-ce que vous pensez que c'est la même méthode Il y en a qui n'en parlent même pas. C'est un sujet tabou. 
Et c'est tabou to talk about a salary. Men salary, c'est very, 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 very dangerous tabou. You can kill at, at, on the spot. Don't talk about it. That's how somebody, or some will say, nah, ils vont dire, ce n'est pas, non, ne parlez pas de ça, ce n'est pas possible. Alors, dites-nous, est-ce qu'on doit parler de son salaire à son épouse? Voilà. À vous de nous faire, bien sûr, vos propositions, mesdames et messieurs. Thank you so much, Frankie Siri. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Frankie Siri says it's a taboo to, you know, to, uh, to some men or for some other men, uh, it's a taboo for the wife to even open the mouth to ask how much are they paid, or how much did you, or how much, just if you want to find out how much he earns, it's a big taboo, but do you think it is? <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, should a man, you know, have full monopoly over his salary without telling the wife how much he earns? That's the question for the day. Now, we would be riding through the program from the Zen. We want to take a break there with the with uh, the first slot for the day, the second slot, if I may say, rather. And when we come back, we would be taking happy birthday. That's birthday wishes from the Zen, the few that has come in already. We're going to say happy birthday to you all. If you're watching, it's your birthday. We may not know. You can as well do the same. I will give you a big shout out from this end. If it's not you, any other person, do the same. Second slot there, ladies and gentlemen. Don't move an inch. We would be right back. Thank you so much, Production Room. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for us to say happy birthday to all those who were born today in the course of this week and this month. That is already rounding up to date. Today is the 31st, and so uh, tomorrow Monday is going to be the 1st of November, ladies and gentlemen. It's equally happy birthday as the month of November opens. We're looking forward to celebrate you, Pastor Bless Sonangu, here in Bafusam. I know your birth month is November. It's a November born king and prince. And so we're looking forward to celebrate you from the Zen, Pastor Bless Sonangu, in Bafusam. Happy birthday to you, Superstar Igor Mboko. Pardon moi, Mama. <laughs> okay, Frankie and Miss B, we saying hi to you, Mboko, superstar. Yeah, happy birthday to you, artist Mboko. Many more hits. Um, we will have you. Oh, I think you help me out here, Chinda. <laughs> <laughs> Christian Chinda. Christian Chinda. <laughs> Happy birthday to you, Monsieur Chinda. Like Miss B is always calling you. <laughs> Many more years to you, Monsieur Chinda. All the best we wish you from this. Uh, Happy birthday to you, Jay. Uh, Chinda is in Bafusam. Igor Mboko in Bafusam. Uh, Jay in uh, Boya. Happy birthday to you. 
Brian Allen Fumuko, pressman in, uh, if it's not the United States of America, I hope Miss B is correct there. Happy birthday to you, many more years. And then, Prizel, happy birthday to you, many more years. Patrick's in Bagante. Good to hear today it's your birthday. Patrick's in Bagante. All right, Patrick's in Bagante. Happy birthday to you. Many more years. Keep connected. If it's your birthday, you can tell us. If it's not your birthday, the birthday of someone quite close to your heart, why not use this opportunity to give the person a big shout out from the Zen birthday wishes, Frankie Cyril. Voilà, nous allons dire euh, bon anniversaire à Vivi Lolo qui est née ce jour. Thank you. Bon anniversaire à David Claude Mbous, Papa Mbous, et qui est un organisateur événementiel. Bon anniversaire à Eleonore Bérénice Lamissa. Hein. Elle a remporté plusieurs concours de Miss. Bon anniversaire à vous. Daniel Paul Chelli, bon anniversaire à vous, très chère dame. Maxime La Pyramide, bon anniversaire. Ils ont eu un an de plus hier, Lady B, et Saïda Samira Suleiman, Rosti Hassan Murphy Yuda, Liuni Nat, Nat La Bombe, et Awalu Ibrahima, Arsène Djoum, Arsène Djoum, Paul Kemonier, Bertin Kwekam, Rodrigue Eyoum, Diane Mogoum, Marie-Jeanne Adou, bon anniversaire, Zena Kalit, bon anniversaire, Blandine Angama, bon anniversaire, Simo Théodore, bon anniversaire, alors Edwige Kouba, bon anniversaire, Flore Deguerre, bon anniversaire, Boris Toukam, en service dans une savonnerie de la ville, bon anniversaire, Daniel Bouquet, mon ami Dani, il a eu un an de plus, hein, il y a quelques jours seulement, Corinne Njomo Owen Sharon. Alors, ils auront un an de plus demain. Demain, eh, Emeline Ngodo, bon anniversaire. Patience Kenye, bon anniversaire. Reine Claude, René Claude Njam, euh, mon, mon euh, parachutiste, hein, militaire parachutiste, bon anniversaire. Chrétienne Chinda, bon anniversaire. Ah, le savant Chinda. Monsieur Chinda, bon anniversaire. Hein? C'est notre ami personnel. Oui. Raoul Azangé, Kaiser, bon anniversaire depuis l'Allemagne là-bas. Parfait Aïssi et toi, le monsieur musclé comme ça, bon anniversaire. Et Nathalie Flore Ndjenge, bon anniversaire. Ndip Mireille Magnon, bon anniversaire. Viviane Madeleine Ondoa Buwele, bon anniversaire à vous. Bona, Bona Richard, Bona, il, a eu, il aura un an de plus. Claude Medio, bon anniversaire. Brenda, Brenda Pia, bon anniversaire. C'est bel et bien le 8, la semaine qui vient là. On va s'arrêter là pour aujourd'hui, mesdames et messieurs. Thank you so much, Frankie Sri. Miss B and Frankie, we join our voices together to give you all the big shout out from this uh, all those who were born to be. Miss Chinda, the rest, happy birthday to you all. All the best you ever wished yourselves. We wish you from this end. Okay, someone is saying hi to us here in the studios of NG Television. That's uh, A. Sophie Jo Maliva, Southwest Region Chief Town Boya. Thank you so much. Happy birthday to you. We have Mola Molombe, who is in colleague giving us happy Sunday from this end. Uh, that's him, Bafusan. Thank you so much, Mola Molombe, telling us happy Sunday from this end. We're going to take a few, a few reactions, and when we come back, it's going to be second song for the day. Mm -hmm. And it's dedicated to this last writer last week, I think. The last writer last week, pray we get that. Okay. Uh, I think the first writer today is Esophie. Joe mm -hmm. Maliva, Southwest Region, Chipton Boya. First song for the day is going to be dedicated to you. I pray that Miss B and Frankie, we keep that. Uh, we're still looking for the last writer last week. Second song for the day is dedicated to you. We're taking some few reactions here as far as the question for the day is concerned. And then we we continue with the program from the Zen. We have you, uh, Adeline, I from a comment. A comment. Uh, Adeline Aifom Akomne says, in my humble opinion, no, when the salary is considered his, it means there is financial separation in the marriage, When whereas the Bible says that the two shall, okay, religious 
Both <laughs> the two shall become one. It means one in love, one in ideas, one in finances, one in emotion, one in motives, one in services, one in everything. Thank you so much, Adeline. That's Press Lady Adeline Ayi from Akomne in Boya. And we have you, uh, Professor Pierre Talakizitu in Bafusam. Uh, who says, uh, hello, in return, why is it that women too always hide their own salaries from their husbands? This is serious. Thank you so much, Prof. Okay, Prof is asking us a question. Mm. Uh, why is it that in return too, women always hide their own salaries from their husbands? Women, if you're hiding your salary from your husband, the two shall become one. We answering the question, Prof. The two shall become one. <laughs> one in ideas, one in finances, as you know, uh, cited by uh, Adeline Aifom Akomne. Thank you so much, Professor Talapie Kizito. Ada Juan says her comment is still on the way. Okay, we're waiting for your comment. Good. Ada Juan says, not a good idea. The two shall become one. All right. Thank you so much. We keep in your text messages from this end ladies and gentlemen but before we go let's have this one from Fogbet Salah uh, Bonjour ou bonsoir uh, l'homme est le chef c'est lui qui doit savoir organiser son foyer il est le maître de ses décisions ils doivent être respectés mais il doit toujours consulter sa côte qui est sa femme voilà c'est notre ami Flaubert qui nous envoie ce message. Merci Flo Flo de Sali. Thank you so much all the way from Douala and there is Peace Book in Limbe. Greetings to you Peace Book. Thank you so much for being part and parcel. And of course the population of Limbe. It's all about you Peace Book. So we seize this opportunity to say hi to the population of Limbe. Talking about Limbe again. We want to greet all those who are down beach right now you know end of month things normally happen mm. uh, if you were in limbe frankie siri where would you have been right now if you weren't on the manche you know? mm. let me say you were in limbe it's weekend it's obvious it's down beach is there yeah. any other area in limbe it's always down beach greetings to all those who are right now enjoying themselves in down beach uh that's uh, down beach in the opaque city that's limbe we go leave limbe we come a little bit backward that's around you know tico greetings to the population of tico tico in the southwest we come behind again we're moving backward we go to champ that's mutengene greetings to the population of mutengene how's the kumba bread no yeah all are not there because Mutengene has its own special bread. You know about mm. that bread? It's so, yeah. more, you know, I was about asking them how is the, the, the price of Kumba bread right now? How is the Saka going? But I think this has to do with K Town. Mm. Uh, there is Randy in K Town. There's uh, Annalyn, good, in K Town. And there's some, is it Berlin? Some other person in K Town. How is Kumba bread doing right now? <laughs> you know, there was the, 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 Okay, the speculated hike mm. in the price of Kumba bread from the normal, you know, 300 francs to 350. But when Miss mm. Bill was, you know, growing back then, uh, we used to buy that in, so, you know, maybe around, we used to buy some around, you know, 250 even. Mm. Bill, no, but I think Miss Bill was buying for 300. But before Miss B started buying for 300, those who were behind Miss B used to buy mm -hmm. for 250. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kumba bread. <laughs> And today, Miss V bought for 300 years. I used to buy 300. Seriously, that was the price. Today, we're hearing that uh, 50 francs, 15 francs. How is it going? Randy in Kumba and Anna, is it Anna, Annabelle? Annaline in Kumba and uh, Be Berin, if I'm not mistaken, in Kumba and lots of others watching us right now in Kumba. Never mind. Kumba bread is just so unique in its taste, in its form, even. Even mm. the beauty of it, I think I'm in support. Yeah, <laughs> very important. Very, All very right, important. it's so beautiful in the eyes. Even the way they take time to put it's so beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Bread. So if, if they feel I agree with you. Fifty francs is too much now. <laughs> fifty <laughs> francs is too. No, no. <laughs> it's not too much. Not too much. It's no, okay. Come on, it's bread we're talking about. And remember, it's not something that you know it's difficult to sell. They buy mm. it every day. That's the probability that you will obviously sell. Yeah. So I think it's slight increase. Is is I mean three hundred is okay because people will always buy. If it were something that it takes a lot of time to buy, we we'll understand. Uh, every day, so you will definitely make your money because people must buy bread, whether they like it or not. 
Okay, let's see how we can solve that. We pray all the best. You know, when it's becoming so hard like that, what do you, what, was, what is Miss B going to do? You know, Miss B was about seeing the, the common man. What was the common woman going to do? Yeah, you will control many <laughs> of your husband. <laughs> All right, Frankie Cyril. Voilà, mesdames et messieurs, c'est bel et bien euh, l'ambiance studio. Et on parlait bien sûr de ce Pankouma qui euh, a sa particularité. Hein, ça, c'est très important. Mais c'est le parfum même est différent. Hein, le perfume you. that you have in Kumba, it's not the same perfume that you have in Bekoko or the stuff of play. Even in Bafusam, you have Kumba bread. But the perfume is not the same. Voilà. Alors, nous allons prendre la deuxième pause musicale. Cette fois-ci, nous restons toujours dans le grand centre. Et nous sommes allés fouiller et nous avons trouvé Richard Amogou. Oh, my God. 
C'était notre ami Richard Amougou. On va dire merci à la réalisation assurée de main de maître par Joël Dickdem là-bas. On espère que nos frères du centre, du sud et de l'est se sont retrouvés de la plus belle des manières dans cette chanson. Hein, au Pédalé, au Picasso. En tout cas, c'est le Bicotsi pur et dur de chez nous. Et ça, ça nous fait plaisir de temps en temps de vous faire partager ces moments-là, mesdames et messieurs. Thank you so much, Frankie Three. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I must say I did enjoy that selection again this afternoon. Last writer last week. Hope you did equally. That was your beautiful dedication this afternoon. If you're just tuning in, the program Sunday at home. We're looking forward to who will be the last writer today. We already have the first day. It's Sophie Jo Maliva, Southwest Region. First song for the day next week will be dedicated to you. And the last writer today, I don't know who that person is going to be. The second song next week is going to be dedicated to you. The program Sunday at Home, live from the studios of NG Television. Uh, in terms of coverage, publicity of our genre, bring the numbers in front of your screen. We continue with some reactions from the Zen. We have John Winston Bacham, all the way from Lagos, Nigeria, who says, uh, tell them half of the salary and keep surprising them with the other guy i'm suspecting you mm -hmm. how can you tell your wife half of salary and you keep so work out surprise no uh when it comes to them as you don't surprise her with other things don't surprise her with salary what do you think about that ladies and gentlemen all right john winston Bechem, all the way from lagos niger says tell them half of the salary and then keep surprising them with the others the other okay i think uh if it's coming from the bottom of your heart that you keep surprising her with the uh, the rest of the salary fine thank you so much john winston Bechen. we buy that we agree with you it's your opinion we respect it from the zen but if you're not in line with it you think uh john winston Bechen, i don't think so you can as well counteract this point of view this afternoon Councillor Klaus Ayemis Tro, all the way from Dubai, that's the United Arab Emirates. He says, Oof, to my best of knowledge, there is nothing like true love, so it doesn't exist. Let's understand that nothing is in motion unless something triggers it to be in motion. The people who choose to sacrifice everything for each other make their love special. The greatest commandment in the Bible tells us to love our neighbors as ourselves. If you cannot love someone as yourself, you are a hypocrite. Therefore, oh, I think it's a long write up there, you know. Good. It says, if you cannot love someone like yourself, I think you are a hypocrite and therefore don't possess any love. So, do unto others what you will wish them to do to you, and the word love will be valuable and glorious. So, straight on point, a million times, Counselor Klaus, I am here too. And after saying that, he comes back to say, that's uh, a secret many fail to know. You need to be true to find your type. If you are true, you will find someone true and love will be realistic. Okay? He's like, you know, do to others what you will have them do to you. So if you're a man, you know that you can take it. If a woman has full control over her salary, don't do that to her. You understand? But if you know you can take it, do to her. 
as well. Thank you so much, Councillor Klaus Ayemesko, all the way from Dubai. That's the United Arab Emirates. It was a long write up here. And so Miss B just had to take time off to, you know, read that all. We have uh, Pauline Manyakanji, Southwest Region Chief Boya, who is like uh greeting us in the studios of ng television thank you so much uh pauline in gm manyaka southwest region chief town boya it's nice to hear from you all this afternoon sunday at home that's the program we say hi to you who is watching us through the social media page is Fijo maliva southwest region chief town boya and counselor Ivan gafferson he in bafu summer we equally have uh, some other persons if i'm not mistaken good we have you, Mahal, in Yawundi. Thank you so much, Mahal. And thank you so much, Lanti, in Bafusam. It's nice to know you all are connected, having us one-on-one, -on -one, even through the social media. We write through the program, four minutes. Uh, is this four minutes? Few more minutes, good. It's like Miss Bates, great. Is it four more minutes? We're already at uh, 4.16? Mm, no, we are 4.16, yeah, right. Four minutes this is serious 16 is going to be 20 you'll yeah. have about eight more minutes eight more minutes eight more minutes to be together ladies and gentlemen we hope uh, uh -huh. we hear from somebody and let's know who is going to be the last writer today so we take on the next slot there we have a break and when we come back we will be taking subscribers from this end Thank you so much production room <laughs> for being on point there it's no other person <laughs> it's joined the dem all right that was just a walk across you know somewhere around uh mm -hmm. in Bafusam. it's nice to know the population of Bafusam is doing just a check uh of course we wish you all an excellent start of you know the week that begins tomorrow the population of Bafusam, and of course happy new month to the population of Bafusam. he in the as the chief town of the west region Thank you so much for Peace Book Limbe being part and parcel of the question of the day today. Thank you so much, Princess Kelly Ngoa, Southwest Region. Thank you so much, PM King Cups, that's Mola in Yawundi, Ada Juan, United Arab Emirates, Catherine Destiny, that's the Middle East Cyprus. Thank you, Councillor Klaus Ayemiesto. Thank you so much for putting a beautiful smile on my faces today. Councillor Ivan Gafferson, thank you so much. Chief Cynthia in Limbe, thank you so much. 
Pauline J. Manyaka, Southwest Region, thank you so much. Kelvin Umama in Yamunde, thank you so much. Epamba Comfort, United States of America, thank you so much. Equa Catherine FSC, Yamunde, thank you so much. Maureen Danze in Sweden, thank you so much. And of course, Wolkan Gingang, thank you so much. Uh, Munge Odilia, thank you so much. And of course, Prof. That's Banjo Heman. Thank you so much, Professor Banjo Heman. He defended his PhD recently mm. the University of Baf uh, Bamenda. I think one oh. of, you know, first PhD PhDs defended in that zone a couple of months back. And then, as if that was not enough, he just got married recently. That's Pressman, oh. Professor Banjo Heman. It's nice to know, guy, you're growing just so up, up. You understand? The sky is not just your limit, but your springboard. That's Miss B's wish for you this afternoon. Thank you, Flo Flo. Thank you, John Wilson Betchem. Thank you. Uh, is there anybody who have left out? Uh, Peace book. Thank you, everybody. For making it what it was today, we're glad you were there. We all were here. Of course, it's Sophie Jo Maliva. We almost left you out. Thank you so much. And thank you, Land in Yaoundé and Mahop in Yaoundé. Thank you all. You all are just the best. Take that beautiful smile there. This big kiss is for you all as you say through this Sunday and enter a new month. That begin uh, that begins tomorrow. Good, it's tomorrow. So all the best. We wish you all from the Zen Sunday at home. The program continues. We are approaching December. Those who have you know plan A, plan B, plan C, as far as attacking the business corner, attacking you know the professional corner service. Maybe you offer a service. When we talk about offering a service to the population, it could be in terms of catering. It could be in terms of you know pressing. It could mm. be in terms of you know in terms of in them so use the numbers in front of your screen the manager of this manager of that colors december is at a corner those who have concerts in town yeah. musicians i know this is the period where lots of you all are having concerts all over and so on ring the numbers in front of your screen will be at your service end of year festivities in terms of schools and their mm. christmas parties you can bring the numbers in front of your screen. We know this period, the lots of schools that will normally do end of, you know, here or December activities, fine. We don't mind coming to, you know, accompany you in the course of your enjoyment. Frankie Siri, I think there is a few more minutes to say ciao from the Zen. Oui, encore quelques minutes et ce sera terminé pour le compte de ce jour, mesdames et messieurs. Ben, nous euh, voulons bel et bien vous dire que ce programme est bel et bien là pour vous. Et ça, on ne cesserait jamais de le dire. Vous avez la possibilité de nous contacter pour communiquer. Les fins d'année sont là. J'ai toujours eu l'occasion de le dire il y a près de deux semaines. Venez communiquer, venez faire connaître vos affaires. Vous savez ce que euh, les populations ont besoin en fin d'année Vous avez la solution, n'hésitez pas, venez communiquer avec nous, venez partager et nous allons vous donner le meilleur, ça c'est sûr. Alors en termes bien sûr de propositions, nous vous ferons bel et bien des propositions alléchantes pour que vous puissiez faire des très très bonnes affaires en cette fin d'année. Alors n'hésitez pas de cliquer ou encore de flasher sur nous. Et nous vous donnerons la bonne graine. Ça, c'est très important. Et je voudrais bel et bien souhaiter hein, déjà beaucoup, beaucoup de plaisir et bon début de mois de novembre à ceux-là même qui euh, vont véritablement reprendre du service demain. Si vous êtes en congé, euh, reposez-vous normalement parce que chaque boulot a besoin de repos aussi. Hein. Prenez vos congés. Mais si vous êtes plutôt congé maladie, remettez-vous rapidement. Vous êtes convalescent, ça c'est sûr. Mais si vous êtes malade, je vous souhaite de vous soigner rapidement parce que il ne fait pas bon d'être très malade dans cette période. Ça ne va pas être bien ni pour vous ni pour votre entourage. Alors prenez soin de vous extrêmement prudent c'est important vous, vous allez prendre la route faites attention soyez vigilant sur la route car on dit la route ne tue pas mais c'est nous qui tuons les tibis 
Thank you, Funky. All the best. I wish you call it from this. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it was nice being in your company. But before we go, we go have the last slot for today, which is always go be. But for some today, whenever you see that slot, it's an indication that Miss B and Frank is really packing these stuffs to get out of the studios of NG Television. So, but for some today, when we come back from it, we will just say goodbye and leave you to be uh, of the best of, you know, state. <laughs>